Hello friends, welcome back in the second part of the FFmpeg video transition tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to concat multiple videos with different kind of transitions. So I'm going to show you how you can uh, combine multiple videos uh, with different kind of transition. So this will be a little bit different, but uh, here we are not going to write a simple command. We are going to write some uh, JS code and this will be run through the Node.js. So we need some prerequisite. First, I will focus on that one. If you are directly coming to this video, then you must know these points. If you do not have a Node.js install on your system, then this process will not work. Okay guys, so I would suggest please watch my first video on FFmpeg video transition in which I have described all the steps for the complete installation about Node.js and FFmpeg concat module which is most important for this tutorial. Please install both of these and then come back and continue here with this tutorial. And this is going to be very easy now. So guys, what we have to do we will concatenate four input videos with three transitions to do that we have to create one simple file with .js extension so I will go through you the steps and this is the code which I have already created so we will use this code and here are the files which are going to be used as a input file file 1 2 3 and 4 now at the same place I will use three transitions to join these files together now I will create one notepad so you can give the name of your choice it's not mandatory to give this name transition but I am giving it to identify it okay guys now open this file and now you need to paste the code just copy this code which is given in the description of this video and paste in this text file now we will understand what we are doing right here you can see the first declaration which is kind of a variable concat and which will work as a function calling or we will say that we are going to create a command or instruction okay so concat is equal to require and then ffmpeg we are passing as an argument after that you can see we have a concat method calling type and then we are passing some json format okay so we have these inputs in a json format so first key is output and the value is the name of the output file we will get this output file as a combination of the four input file now this is the key videos and the value is the array and the array is the name of all these four input files in case you want to concatenate 5 or 10 then please increase the file name in this array now the next key is transitions so in the transitions we have the combination or you can say the pair of two keys first one is uh, the name the name is the transition name and the second was in, in duration in my first video of the FFM back transition I have explained about the duration the duration of the transition is in millisecond if you increase the value then the duration time will increase if you increase this duration value which is in millisecond then your transition will be very fast so we have just added these three transitions because we have four videos so first transition will fit between video 1 and 2 the second transition is Q which will fit between the video 2 and 3 and the third transition which is angular which will fit between the videos third and fourth now this is the way if you have five or six videos so 
the same way you can increase the transitions so this is a complete thing and now this is ready to run now the final thing we will change the file extension from txt to js okay we have just changed it and just click outset and this file will change to this one now guys finally we have to run this file as an executable file so now it's very simple we have to simply open command prompt and now we have to type a simple command node and then file name okay so at the same place where we have all the input files I have just opened my command prompt and now I am going to run the this JS file node space the name of the file press enter this will take 5 to 10 seconds for start processing uh, once the processing is started you will see green statements start printing on this console and this process will take the time but it depends on the video quality and the video length of the input so we are waiting for the final processing and uh, which will start in next few seconds okay this is started you will see the first message in it frames and this is keep going on so you have to wait for that and this will complete in next one or two minutes in my case because my video length input video length is very short and this will be completed soon and guys we finally reached at the prompt in the C prompt and uh, the final output video is generated now we will play this file and we will see the transition that we have applied okay here we go I'm going to play with the media player and just file going to be play and file is here now we will see this is our first crosswire transition now it's time to check the cube transition it's fine now we are going to check our third transition which is angular okay it's working fine so guys all these transitions are perfectly placed as we were expecting okay so these are the files we have used four files and three transitions if you are using more videos then the transition will be one less and these are the transitions and these also given in the description of this tutorial you can pick and use these transitions and try more and all these stuffs also given in the description for your help and uh, you can try it I hope you guys found this video tutorial relevant and useful please like this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe my channel and for now thanks for watching cool IT help